man detained after pointing gun at Argentina vice president. A man has been arrested after pointing a gun inches from the face of Cristina Fernandez de Kirchner, Argentina's vice president and former president, as she was greeting supporter outside her home in the Buenos Aires neighborhood in Recoleta. The Argentina's newspaper Carlins reported that a 53 years old Brazilian man has been arrested at the scene. The dramatic event on at 9 p.m. on Thursday were captured by television cameras standing vigil outside Fernandes de Kirchner's homes, where supporters had been gathered for days protesting against corruption charges filed against her at court. The footage showed the man pushing through supporters, raising a gun to Fernandes de Kirchner's face, and apparently attempted a shoot, which seemed to misfire. Some reports say the man pointed the gun at Fernandez de Kirchner, but did not fire. The two times former president, Argentina's leading political figure, can be seen reacting, covering her face and hunching down. She appeared to be unharmed. A person who was identified it by those who were close to him, who had a gun, was detained by the vice president's security personnel. They set him aside, found the weapon, and now it must be analyzed. Security Minister Aniba Fernandez told local cable news channel. The minister said he wanted to be careful in providing details until the investigation learns more. The level of verbal violence has been growing alarmingly among opposition politicians in Argentina this year, mainly centered around corruption charges. Filed again, Fernandez de Kirchner in court. Some extreme opposition's politicians have called for the death sentence to be reintroduced for the vice president. After the incident, a statement from Fernandez de Kirchner's Fritens de Todos party said the incident meant to hatches emanating from different spheres of political, media, and judicial power against the former president. Only led to climate of extreme violence. The economy minister Sergio Massa called the incident an attempt assassination. When hate and violence prevail over debate, societies are destroyed, and situations like these arise. Attempted assassination, he said in a tweet. The former president Mauricio Macri demanded an immediate investigation into this extreme serious attack. Which fortunately caused no harm to the vice president. They wanted to kill Kirchner, tweeted Argentina's foreign minister Santiago Carrero. This is the most serious act of political violence since the return of democracy. Fernandez de Kirchner is embroiled in long-running accusations that she favored the construction firm of a close ally for road contract. During her two terms as president, from 2007 to 2015, in her home province of Santa Cruz, prosecutor Diego Luciani last week urged a 12-year sentence of convicted provoking widespread protests across Argentina, including in front of Fernandez de Kirchner Buenos Aires home. She responds, saying that the charge were politically motivated. And that she is facing a judicial mediatic fearing squad. Report that the alleged culprit, that Brazilian sent shock wave through Brazil, where fear have been growing that the extremist rhetoric of its far right president Jair Bolsonaro might inspire some kind of violence incident. Brazil is a month away from presidential election, in which Bolsonaro will face off against his bitter rival. The leftist former president Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva, Lula has reportedly taken to wearing a bulletproof vest at rallies for fear of a similar attack from right-wing extremists. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.